So we are at the UFC Performance Institute. So there goes Brendan Allen. There goes Daniel Gracie. Like everything you've seen here, you, you think you saw in a gym before, but you didn't. It's everything top level, like the way they made the things are for professional athletes and to last forever. And it's funny because when you think they're not gonna do anything different, you get here and there's a different material, different bike, different thing that you never seen all over. Like there's nowhere in the world that it is. This is the best facility in the world, period. Rips for like, kind of like a mountain climb. Yeah. UFC Performance Institute. For sprints. Oh, wow. This is crazy. What? Yo, they spared no expense here, man. Like, oh wow, how much oxygen can you observe when you're like working out? Like, this is like, look at this uh, treadmill. I don't know if you can see, but look there. Oh wow, another level, another level, right? Another level, yeah. Crazy. This reminds remember Rocky, uh, four when he went to Russia and the yeah, Russians were like, like, the performance, even Drago was, yeah. Drago, was, this is this is the look outside, this, there's a performance uh, place for parties and. Okay, yeah. And on the other side is the, is the cafeteria where you eat. Nothing like that. So I saw a bunch of uh, like some of these big UFC fighters that are here right now. They're coming here all the time? All the time. All the time. All the time. Some people move to Vegas just to use this facility. Okay. You have to understand, once you are a fighter, uh, you are allowed to use that every day as many times as you want. Plus, you can go to massage, physical therapy, whatever you want to do. I see there's a fighter there now, a massage, physical therapist, and uh, here, the nutritionists that work for the UFC right now, they're taking care of the fighters. So right. if there's any fighter that is uh, performing, let's say, Saturday, this Saturday, or next week, and they're feeling not so good, they angry, they come talk to this people, and they, they know exactly what they're gonna eat, when they're gonna eat, and how they're gonna cut their weight. Okay. That's awesome. They give us what we need. Yeah, is it good food? Is it taste good though? Yeah, I mean, we don't eat for taste here. Okay, fair <laughs> enough. Fair but enough. It's not, it's not bad, it's not That's bad. That's what's up. So this is cryotherapy? Yeah, this one. This one, it looks like a tanning Tanning slob, right? right? I forgot what is that. It's, I, that's for recovering. I'm gonna get in here. So what is this? Cryo. To freeze you? It's like a freezer. <laughs> Cryo build. All right, so Daniel, explain this. So this is the like, treadmill, okay? And also a swimming pool. Like, how are you gonna swim in a small pool like that? So those things right there, they push water so, so hard and so strong yeah. that you're gonna be blasting swimming and you're on the same spot. If you stop, you come back to the wall, so you have to be swimming, swimming in the same spot. Plus, that's a treadmill. And what? Are, those are cameras for what? Those are cameras to to film your performance. Are you swimming? If you're swimming right, if you're running right, those, those, the TV right there shows. Yeah. Uh, they film inside of the water. And so there's a sauna over there, and there's jacuzzis sauna, over there. Steam room. Steam room. The cryogenics. Yes, but yeah. Yeah. jacuzzi. Right there, jacuzzi. And this is the one that you're gonna get in. <laughs> what is the freezing pool? Oh, hell no. <laughs> I, know, I don't know about that. Just your foot. Just okay. put your foot in. Oh, oh Jesus Christ. <laughs> you're crazy, man. So you can be there less than one minute. That's crazy.